So you're on insulin right now? Yes, sir. Five shots a day. Okay. Any other medical problems you take medicine for? Asthma, high blood pressure, high cholesterol. You know, I got the whole list. Sure. <laughs> got it. But here's what I'll tell you. The, the medical problems that you've told me about, the majority of those, you have roughly about an 80 to 85% chance of resolving those. If you have weight loss surgery and you're compliant with eating the way that we want you to afterwards. So from that standpoint, you're an excellent candidate. So Chris, how much do you think you weigh right now? Not too long ago, I weighed and I was right at 420, 419, 420. Okay. You want to see what you weigh? Yeah, I'll step on All right, let's do it. Ninety-seven and a half. What? I don't think the scale's accurate because I don't believe I'm under 400 pounds. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you this. It's been like eight years since I've been under 400 pounds. Chris lost 20 pounds in a month. I'm happy for him. So Tammy, do you have any idea what you're weighing right now? Now, I know from Dr. Proctor's records, I think we were right around 595 on the last visit. Is that correct? Mm -hmm. So you want to see what this weight is? I if I have to. <laughs> yeah, we got to get it done. We got to start somewhere, OK? All right. I am nervous getting on the scale. All I can think about is, I hope the number don't go up. Take your time. Just stand right there in the middle and you can use those rails. So we're at 644 and a half right now. I didn't even think that was humanly possible. You know, gaining 50 pounds in 30 days, you almost have to exert yourself and overeat on purpose to gain that kind of weight. Cause that's, well, that's a pound and a third a day. <laughs> Tammy's been doing nothing but eating. <laughs> 